Hey guys, I'm here with another Muku haul, and I've been really excited for this one. Um, it just came in today, and I was, you know, I called my mom, and I'm just like, is it here yet? Is it here yet? Is it here yet? <laughs> so, I, I was so excited when she told me it came, and um, this is a haul from Sherry Lynette, and she is, or, yeah, she has... Um, Ariel's Secret Garden, which is homemade goat soap, goat milk soaps. I can talk. So this is her Etsy store. See, here's Etsy, and then she's real big on Halloween, and she's really good about incorporating the holidays and stuff. And that's the banner, and then they have really nice pictures too. Just shows how much like she really cares, you know. She wants to make sure her stuff looks really good. So, I've I've never personally really been into soaps, but um, she has a YouTube channel and I started watching that and it made me wanna try them. And wow, I, I like can't get enough now. So, one lady and her magic goat keeping America squeaky clean. That is so, true I'm sure especially since she has like over 1,500 sales wow so her stuff is really really good she's been doing this for a long time I don't know anyway so enough about that but we'll go to what I got in my package yay so my package came in in this just priority mail box but she went and put a bunch of little really cute stamps on it and it came with all that paper in there everything was wrapped and I haven't opened any of them just so you guys can pretty much see but this was on top it's just a little cupcake and it has a thank you on there with some really cute um, cobweb Halloween ribbon there was lots of this in there like bat confetti and this guy was on the top so that's cool. I have a friend that'll like really like that. So that's awesome. And then my order was this. I ordered these. Um, I ordered a bar of uh, Candy Girl, which smells so good. Ugh. It's. I think it's my favorite of of what I ordered. Is is this? I haven't tried any of this yet. So if you guys want me to make a review video, I totally will. But um, this is basically just smells like, it's like a really, it's like a sweet vanilla scent. It's like a fruity vanilla. That's the best way I can, I can describe it. It's, it's really light though. That's why I really like this. And then uh, it's made with, um, saponified blend of olive oil, canola oil, and coconut oil, honey, goat's milk, micas, and fragrance. And it's got little candies on the top, and it's, like, totally cool. And then I got bubble bars, which basically, I've never even heard of bubble bars before. But I saw her videos, and I saw what they do. So, basically, you take this, and this is huge. You crumble it up under the bath water, and it's supposed to make, like, a bunch of bubbles in this scent and, like, tint your water. It's supposed to be amazing. So, I got Rockstar. I got basically like the scents that I've heard of that are really good. So, I got Candy Girl, Rockstar, and then um, Sweet Talker. Which, that one doesn't say Sweet Talker. That one says Sweet Talker. <laughs> so, the Rockstar ones are like, they're pink. And then they have like this glitter on the top. And then they have the cute little black ribbon for Halloween. And the Rockstar... It's, it's, I don't know how to describe that. It's, I want to say it's like, a, it's not floral, but it's like a, it's like a candy scent almost. It's like a candy scent. I can't, I can't tell you which candy right now because I'm just like, almost smells like a jawbreaker. That's what I'm going to say. It smells like a jawbreaker. And then Sweet Talker is this blue and it comes with a cinnamon stick on top, which that's kind of cool. And then. Oh, I love this one. It's it's a really good vanilla. 
Oh, it's it, this one's like a like Candy Girls of Fruity Vanilla. This one is like um It's a really good vanilla. I can't, <laughs> I can't, like, I'm sorry. I am just, like, brain dead today. And then, so that's what I ordered, was these bubble bars, which are huge. I'm going to get, like, three baths each out of all of those. And then, plus this, dear God, I'll be set for, like, ever. And then she gave me three gifts. So, um, she just made a new soap called Bewitched. And it's like this really cute star, and it's got a bunch of, I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that? Yeah, kind of. You can kind of see that. But there's lots of glitter on there, and it's like a little chunky star, and it's a, it's like a fruity peppermint smell. And that's really cool, because I watched her make that. And then um, Mardi Gras and a cute little ladybug. Which I just might have to like give half to my friend or something because she loves ladybugs. But anyway. Oh, that smells so good. This is like a really um, fruity scent. And it's kind of, it's almost like a sherbet almost. It's really, it's, <sighs> these smell so good guys. Like I can't even describe. And I know this video is taking a long time. And this is the last one I got. It's called Tea for Two and it's in the shape of a little bumblebee, which these totally terrify me, but this is actually really cute, so. And then this has kind of like a smell of spices, and it's a really warm smell, so um, I might use it, but I think I'm just going to give this one to my mom, because I told her I was going to let her try some of this, that's because I want her to help me buy the next time that I go there, which I told Sherry that I would. So... Sherry, thank you so much. I love all of this. It's all wonderful. And I can't wait to buy again. So, um, so yeah, if you guys want a review of any of this stuff, be it the, the bar of soap or these ones or the bubble bars or what, whatever, um, go ahead and let me know and... I, I'll go ahead and do that, but, um, as for charms and stuff, I just finished a bunch, I just have to get them on chains and stuff, so that stuff will be coming up really soon, and then I'm going to be posting some of my cosplay items on my Etsy, so that's also coming soon. So, alright guys, Sherry, thank you so much, it's awesome. Have a wonderful bubble-filled night. <laughs> Bye.